This is a brief demonstration on how to set up and link an internal Nessus scanner to Tenable I.O. First, log in to Tenable I.O., navigate to Scans. Then in the left-hand side, Scanners, you should see a linking key. The linking key, make sure you copy that. That is your key to actually register the local Nessus scanner, either that be on Linux, Mac OS, or Windows. Then you're actually going to install the Nessus application. Here is for a Linux system. So I'm just going to install this particular package. Once this is completed, you'll then log into the web interface of the local Nessus scanner. All Nessus scanners by default will be HTTPS, the IP address port 8834. And that will be the same regardless of which operating system you choose to install Nessus on. So I'm going to start the service here. And then I'm going to nav navigate to the web interface. Now you're going to then create a username and password for the Nessus scanner after it initializes. All right. Now you're going to create a username and password. That is up to you on what you would like that to be. Then you're going to hit the drop down, select manage by Tenable IO, and then paste in that linking key that I told you to copy through the Tenable IO interface. You're just gonna hit continue, and that will be it. And that's the setup for the Nessus scanner. You'll then be able to see that scanner will then show up in the scanner section of your Tenable IO interface. And here is my scanner that I just linked. The same process will be the same as far as Windows. You just install the MSI file. All right, once completed, similar to the Linux installation, you'll just navigate to the web interface over HTTPS, the IP address port 8834.